For the past six years, I've been coming to the park to paint. I think it makes you aware of the shortness of life, just like the shortness of the peak of the garden. It's about 10 days and it's, they start to die. It has given me inspiration and I look at the garden almost like a metaphor for paradise or the search for paradise. To study the light falling over the shapes gives me a, a chance to work somewhat abstractly and yet the average person can look at it and see a flower garden. If they want to look at it in a different way, they might see more. But a beautiful day with beautiful light marks one of the most enjoyable experiences one can have. Sometimes working as an artist can seem more like a curse than a blessing because you're compelled to work and you ask everyone around you to make sacrifices because of your work. And it isn't defined by everyone's idea of fun. And you feel compelled to keep going. I think as an artist you're you're aware of time, more so as you get older. And time slipping away. You always hear things like, well, Michelangelo had 24 hours in a day too. But the circumstances around creativity are vastly different depending on where you live and what community you're in and what are the artistic demands of the community or who cares. So those kind of things can force a little bit of panic. Those 24 hours don't seem very long. And you don't know how Michelangelo did it. I think the real fruits of your labor is the enjoyment of creation. Painting is in itself... Um, sheer fun even though it doesn't look like it A certain kind of panic sets in when you realize how important each day is to a painting like this. Working from life. There's a big storm last night, so the flowers took a beating. There's branches down. And
It helps you realize how significant each day is, how important each day is in your life. In theory, you'd like to try not to waste it. This is Sibley Park, where I've been doing these paintings. The garden is already peaking. Some of the uh, blossoms are dying. The color is fading. And several beautiful sections were taken out last night by a storm. I have to work faster. It's nice because not that many people come around when I'm working. I can have a little bit of freedom. I can actually do this without people interrupting. One of the interesting things that happens is people do come around and they'll say something like, it's such a gift. And I do appreciate that. And I think about it.